Hello there. Um, SG Maniac in the building here. Beautiful night in New Jersey. Um, yeah, thank you very much to cool person on Instagram. I forget your Instagram handle for requesting this, but I wanted to do a quick tutorial. Uh, show you how to play this song that I wrote. Thank you guys so much for listening. It really like means a lot to me that people are out there listening to this song and enjoying it. Um, I'm just like plugged in to my computer because my downstairs neighbors just had a kid and like like a week ago. So I'm trying to be cool because they yell at me a bunch for making noise. So here we go. Um, the main riff is like, it's the D scale. It's D. Listen, if you're not if you're not in with the D major scale, I suggest that you uh, you check it out. You Google it. You you Google images of it. You YouTube it. You listen to it on repeat. D major scale scale is really good, good uh, good for your soul. So, but the intro riff is is actually a little bit. It's it's like a pentatonic scale, so it goes like this. <laughs> Yeah, so I'm just like go. I'm starting on fifth fret of this yonder A string here. Um, and I'm just gonna walk up five, seven, nine. Pretty standard pentatonic scale. Um, yeah, that's a that's the main riff. The chords that I'm doing here are. Starts off with a D major. There's like lots of ways to play this stuff, but I like to, I like to play it up here. Then B minor, D minor, G major. So you can like kind of do a nice little bar chord guy up here. Um, start up the tenth fret. I like to play with like my thumb. I have monster hands. Um, and I broke my pinky when I was really little. It's kind of curved. I, I broke it playing catch with a Nerf football. So it stretches out. It gives me like a kind of unusually large reach on the guitar neck. But uh, so I like to play with my thumb on the low E string, um, kind of like a bass, bass note. So 10th fret. Um, you can do like a nice bar chord. Bar chords are cool. If you don't know what a bar chord is, Google it, uh, Google image it, YouTube it, look it up on Craigslist. Bar chords are cool. Then B minor, you can just kind of like take that chord and move it down, make it a minor chord. That's the seventh fret. Fifth fret, A minor, same chord. These are two of the same chord, I just move it down two frets. It's 7th fret on the E string, so it's just 7th fret on the E, D, and G string, it's a bar chord, move it down to the 5th fret, you got yourself an A minor chord, now finish it up nice and strong with this G major chord, um, and yeah, you can move that all over the neck, so I like to play it down here. practicing your instrument. Have fun. I hope I was able to actually teach you something. Thanks for watching.